Hello everyone, Crystal Vigia here. Welcome to another part of my Let's Play of Crash Team Racing Nitro Fuel. I was just thinking about the fact that I've played as Crunk for the third time in a row here, which is, uh, that's a record. Three levels in a row with the same guy. But you know what? Crunk is cool. And I appreciate and respect Crunk. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, we haven't. That's actually in the second time. Oh, well, I'm a complete idiot. I'm a complete idiot. It is the second time. Um, what was it? Oh, I was using Papi Papi for... Uh, Dragon Mines, that's right, right. Anyway, we're playing as Crunk again because I like Crunk. It's as simple as that. Uh, Alright, here we go. You know what? This might be a perfect opportunity for Crunk. Or not, because I know I was, um, I was doing a live video of, uh, I was doing like a, like, sorry, a, um, what was it called? Like a, a race. And there was a guy, actually, his name was, I think it was like Dark Jack. Um, and he actually was, funnily enough, a subscriber, and he absolutely schooled us on this. Absolutely schooled. Like, embarrassed. Like, there was nothing I could do to be quicker, and a part of it did feel a little bit like Papu Papu, um, but not, you know, like, I'm not blameless, that's for sure. I'm, well, sorry, I am, yeah, I'm definitely not blameless. Like, it was definitely me not being as good either, but I thought Papu Papu maybe, maybe wasn't the right one to sort of get over some of these humps and stuff like that. Um, oh, go. oh, I hit it too late. Hit it too late. Hey, Team Cortex vehicle. Give me that. Right. Yeah, Tiny Arena, great level, I think, um, because you kind of get to see, there you go, sucker. Sucked in Mr. Electron Skin or Mrs. Electron Skin. Um, yeah, one thing I love about this level is look, look at all the detail in the background there. It's kind of like in the city sort of thing. It's like really cool. You can't see much of the city in the background, but when you do see a little bit of it, it's really, really cool. There we go. Whoa, whoa. Whoa. Oh, yes. We can get some of that momentum. You see there's like all this cool graffiti on the on the thing. It's like an Aku Aku mask. There's a as a, tr uh, what is it called? Like, like level, the level name uh, of, of other level names. It's like, it's like they're like other arenas. I guess from a law standpoint, that's basically saying that they actually did set these up. They're not just like existing from the levels. They're like actually being set up intentionally to race. Um, in Jack X, it's kind of positioned as in like you kind of, they turn the, the, the streets of Haven City and, and wherever you were, you know, in the game into like an actual location. But I actually like it how it's like these like separate locations and they're like actual battle arenas for for the I was gonna say for the wrestlers. For the uh, for the races. The crash team races. Who you never actually as a team at all. That's why it's kinda of funny, it's like Team Bandicoot, because that's from Nitro Cut. Nitro Cut doesn't have anything to do with team, like in the title, but it's actually the most team sort of I get oh I guess tag team racing is the most one, but yeah. See, at least, at least Tag Team Racing actually put, like, what it does in the title. It's like, there's no teaming element, really, of, of CTR. Anyway, that's just me being, you know, silly. All right, we've got this. I love it, the intermittent fire blasts as well. Uh, just a crazy, crazy level with great lighting, great dirt. You know, who knew that video game analysis has got to the point where we talk about dirt? Well, we're at that point, okay? We're at that damn point, and you're going to have to accept it. Or, you know what? Be left behind. Be left behind. Be left behind in a world where you don't talk about dirt textures in a video game. Okay? And you know what? That's broke. That's not woke. It's broke. There's a big tiny guy up there too. Like a big sort of elect... Was that kind of like a metal tiny? That'd be a cool skin actually. Metal tiny would be great. Is, it, is there one? I don't think so. There's Doberman tiny. There's like other weird like white... Tiger Tiny or whatever, something like that. Interesting that uh, you got Pura, who is a male, by the way. Um, I know people, a lot of people thought that Pura was actually female, but um, uh, yeah, you got that Tiger, and then you got Tiny Tiger. Tiny, Tiny, maybe maybe Tiny is uh, genetically, you know, maybe, maybe they're related. You never know. Actually, they're actually different kinds of Tiger Tigers, aren't they? There we go, and that was a disappointing end there. Sorry. Four minutes, four minutes. Could have been three minutes and uh, 59.5 or something like that, but what can I say? I am very, very excited, by the way, about the, um, about the, uh, what's it called, the, the next section here. Alright, let's do that. 
this cutscene. We're actually going to get a new cutscene. 80 points. Coins. Here we go. Crunk wins, mate. Crunk wins. You know what we're going to do? We're going we're gonna to play as Nash in the, in the next part, actually. Oh, that's so good. Okay, we got a Team Cortex card. Yes, I am so keen. All right, let's let's change character. Okay, can I just say once again, once again? Oh, I have uh, Geary too, by the way, guys, and Big Norm. Um, I absolutely love the fact that we can actually, you know, okay, hit that one and confirm. Yeah, I absolutely love the fact that. Whoa, this is cool. Whoa. Okay. There you go. Cool. Yeah, I absolutely love the fact that added all that that lore, all that cutscene lore. It's just it's just brilliant. All right. He feels fast. I mean, yeah, okay. Anyway, I'm gonna leave it. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. In the next part we're going to face and hopefully defeat Komodo Joe in a pretty difficult level, because Dragon Mines ain't easy. Thank you guys once again for the continued support as well. Uh, it means a lot that so many people are checking this LP out. And let me know what you think. Please leave a comment. Uh, I want to engage with you all, talk about the game, and uh, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll speak soon. See you then.